like you're instantly recognizable. And even if people are unsure once they hear the voice. Then that's they know. It. So that's what, it. Does that happen when you're back in Scotland as well? The same kind of thing? No. No. <laughs> they don't care. I think I'm more, yeah, no, because in Scotland I don't stand out. In Scotland maybe I stand out a little bit for the other side yeah. because my accent's gotten a lot softer. Yeah, and, no so. kidding. So it's know, not it's as weird. pure. It's not as pure. And they don't like that in Scotland. You know, they, don't, they, they, they like to hear a thick Scottish accent. So whenever I go back, I literally am practicing on the plane. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Hello, it's good to be back. Um, and I always go There's to There's Gerard this, reading for a part, exa I guess. Exactly. And I go to the Starbucks, and I know they're waiting there going, how's he going to say cafe latte? So I'm always like, you know, I'll have a grande latte, please. Um, <laughs> And they're like, all right, okay, you can get away with it. Makes <laughs> <So, yeah. laughs> me want to be on a plane with you. I know. <laughs> Just to hear it. Yes.